So guys, in our previous video, I showed you how to make a bridge. So in this one, I'm going to show you how much it can hold. Please like, share, and subscribe. So we're finished with our bridges. We let them dry for a few days. Now we're going to add some weights well, to we, them. We need a cup to hold the weight. So what we're going to do is we're going to hole punch two holes in, in the Now we're going to get some string and we're going to put it through the holes so then we can add it to the bridges. So now guys, we're going to weigh our bridges. So let's pick up mine. Mine weighs 3.7. Mine weighs 3.77. Now we need something to for the bridges to span across. Now we're gonna put our bridges up on top. Now we're gonna tie the weight to the bottom of the bridge. So we have a lot of coins, now we're gonna fill them up. The bridge weighs 3.77 ounces. Now we're gonna see how much it can hold. <laughs> That's basically the entire cup. So if we ran out of weight, we're gonna put some Hot Wheels in. We're putting Hot Wheels in now. It's gonna crack. Oh! Oh! Is it? It's gonna crack. Take cover! It's gonna blow! It, it, it's gonna blow. <laughs> it's now it's time to do mine. So guys, now it's my turn to break my bridge. So we're going to start with our fox. When Aiden was doing his, he put his coins in first. And actually, he when then when he was doing his rocks, he didn't have room to put his rocks. So we're going to do our rocks first. Wish me good luck. One, two, now it's time to do three coins. Continue. Guys, we had to resort to adding two cups to hold the coins in the rocks. You can see the top of the map. We're out. So let's find some. We're gonna, we found some more rocks, so now we're going to add that. So look at the bridge, it's going to fall. Soon. Okay. Fall soon. Okay. That was a lot of rocks and coins. So guys, we had to get a big bowl to hold all our stuff. So with the bowl, it's zero. So I'm gonna grab, start piling. That was our final. So we ended up with eight, 83.80. Oh wait, we forgot the cups. Let's add the cups. 84.40. Okay, so now we're gonna see how much it held. Wow, look how much that held. So guys, we need to add the cup to Aiden's because we forgot to. So Aiden had so guys, my bridge weighed 3.7 ounces. It could hold 84.4. And it could hold 22 of itself, but 23, it would break. So now let's do Aiden's. Aiden's bridge weighed 3.77. He could hold 52.76. And he could hold 13 of himself, but on the 14th, I'm gonna help you understand break. how much this bridge could actually. So imagine if I had a bridge on top of a canyon. And I could hold 22 of its exact same bridges. But if I added like 23 bridges, 
this whole thing would have collapsed. What would have made our bridges stronger? So, the three, th I think there's a couple of stuff that would make our bridges stronger. So, you could put some cardboard on the road bed, that would make it stronger. Or, you could put a bunch of triangles on top of your spaghetti sticks. And this is the main reason why your bed, your road, your bridge is so Tonight's strong. Tonight's River Point, we're going to see how strong the bridge is without its triangles. Oh, it's going to snap soon. Bye. Nice. Nice so guys, now I'm wondering how much the bridge would hold without its triangles. So, let's see. So guys, it would weigh 12.31. It could basically hold four of itself. The roadbed was strong, but if you look up here, these things were... the. If we didn't have the triangles, it would have snapped pretty easily. So, once my triangle, once the triangles were snapping, it was kind of fun to watch the bridge, like, bend. But then when my triangles were snapping, basically my whole, my whole bridge would break. So this is about the end of this video. Hopefully you did enjoy. Please like, please subscribe, and also please comment. And guys, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!